My name is Johnny Leo. I'm co-founder of Fountain. Um, it's really a very different show in the, that it's, it's all inclusive. There's many elements that come into play. Not only do you have exhibiting galleries, you have independent artists, you have collaboratives, you have street art, you have performance art, you have music, you have all of these elements that encompass all art, not just the painting on the wall or a sculpture on the floor. It's all encompassing, it's exciting, it's innovative, it's, it's unlike any other show that's out there. Fountain was founded in 2005 by myself, David Kesting and Lincoln Kapla on a trip to Miami. When we visited all the other shows, we went to Scope, we went to Basel, we went to all the big shows, but there was no, no representation of small, young, emerging talent and young, emerging galleries. Independent galleries were swept under the rug, and now we've created this show, Fountain, which has grown from three galleries in 2006 to, in 2011, in New York City, we had over 60 galleries represented here at the 69th Regiment Armory. We formed a, a loving relationship with all of the staff here and really have a tremendous respect for the venue itself. Seeing that it was the home to the first contemporary art fair in 1913, where our favorite Papa Duchamp dropped new descending a staircase on a, a very skeptical and hesitant audience. I think Marcel Duchamp would be thrilled to see that his style and his influences span such a long, long time period. What keeps this show going is not just not just the people coming through the doors, it's the people that are collecting the work. It's the artists that are taking the risk to exhibit alongside of us. It's the artists that are continuing to come back. Crews like the Murder Lounge, and innovative groups like Non Grata that come through. Uh, exhibiting galleries such as McKeg Wells, such as Grace Exhibition Space. Uh, Fountain is going to continue to grow. Not only will it continue to captivate audiences in New York City and Miami, but it will also expand. You know, what separates us from all the other shows as well is the accessibility. There's always a musical element, there's an interactive element, there is a performative element that's wandering through the space and meandering and engaging everybody. It's not just your regular white walls show. But again, it all the greatest thanks goes to the artists, to the continuing exhibitors and galleries that help make this show what it is.